you keep going on about the money. It's not about that for me. It's not important to me, James. If anything, it's it's because of the money is why you go into jail in the first place. Look, I, I just don't want my first kids being brought up without his dad in his life. It's just not what I want, James. Hang on, so what are you saying here now? Are you actually coming out with this shit to me now weeks before I go away? This shit? See, that's your attitude about it. You just don't get it. Get what? There's nothing to get. You don't realise how lucky you are, you know? Do you know what? You, you've got a chance here to bring a kid up and be looked after. Fucking most girls around here have jumped to the chance. I'm not like that and you know that. I've got a plan, I've got goals, I've got dreams and... Do you know what, James? Bringing up a kid on my own isn't one of them. No? You know, you came to my school years ago. Yeah. <laughs> Service doesn't do that anymore. Preemptive learning. Costs, red tape, bullshit. Was I any good? Pretty shit, actually. <laughs> I mentioned it to me dad, though. You know, when we started this. He knew you. Yeah? Came through the system too, did he? Nah. He knew you from way back. Mentioned the 80s, all the trouble, you and him. Had a twinkle in his eye. After the Americans came, it wasn't just musicians who were poor. When I was posting at Maja, I was really excited. Brutish muck about it. My father tried desperately to find me a husband. Singing Ronan Keating's hardcore when you say nothing at all in the style of Dr. Dre. Women are too soft. This is a real combat zone. I fled. 